What's going on guys, it's Attractive Boost here and I'm bringing you guys another deck profile today and it's on Dino Toads, right? Dino Toads, right? Dino Toads, yeah. Nice. So, um, how was your matchups today? I played Herald of Perfection, my second game, I won that one, they bricked on game three. And I played against Performer Pals and they got destroyed. Nice. Alright, let's go off into the deck. Uh, we're going to start off with Monsters? Yes. Okay, cool. Uh, monster lineup. We got the Frog Engine. Oh, yeah. um, just set him like right here. Yeah. Triple Duke. Yep. Uh, triple Swap. Uh, double Ronin Toad. Yep. The basic Toad stuff. And that's basically it for the Frog Engine. Yeah. Uh, let's try to turn him this way. Yeah. So it's just you know. I got you. I'll put him upside down for you. And then we go into the Dinosaurs. Uh, Triple of this guy. I don't even know. Uh, Oviosaurus. Oh yeah. Oh, so even Oviraptor. Yeah, so yeah, he's really good. And then I got Miscellaneousaurus. Three of him. Yeah, the protector. Double conductor. I might throw in the triple because I want to see him more. Yeah. Um, and the babies. I got the pterodactyl baby. I played two of him. And I played two of baby swords. Nice, Only because man. I gotta make room for the frog. Yeah. So to make room for both engines, I had to go with the most default basic set. Yeah. Um, and then one Megalo as an extra dinosaur target to summon and go into my login, my Doka plays, yeah. and a Maxi. Nice. When I see it, people don't want to do much. Yeah, very basic. Yeah, very basic. <laughs> it's still in a uh, construction. I'll go to the traps now. Um, I love traps. Yeah. And I play 1D Barrier. Yep. I like it at 1. You know, people like it more, but eventually when Link Summon comes out, it's going to go down. It's going to, yeah. It's going to go down. But it's not on there. Yeah. And it's still mad expensive. Yeah. So. Uh, Solid yeah. Morning. Quaking. I did have Rippling at first, but I kept having monsters out there, and they would attack, and Rippling was useless. So. Yeah. Rippling can be good, but only if you have open fields. So. Yeah. Uh, one Torrential. Um, I, my draw engine are traps, and I use, uh, they're basically Jar of Greed, so, uh, Legacy of Yada and Jar of Greed. But I want it to be double Yada, uh -huh. only because uh, I always play I always play Yada, and everybody, nobody knows what it does. Yeah, no so, I, I barely know. <laughs> so I, I like to confuse my opponent, make them think more about what they think I'm playing and stuff yeah. like that. So all it does, allows you to draw one. Yeah. Um, I also play Double Lost Win because... It's a really good card. Yes. You know, very you can use it over and over again. Extra decks are very heavy nowadays. And people special summon a lot. Yeah, too much. <laughs> you could use this on Herald of Perfection if you could bait out all the fairies from Percy's hand. You could yep. use this on Toad if you bait out his negate. Um, it's very good. And when they summon them, you can bring them back from the graveyard. That's a great card. Uh, double Call the Haunted to get back either my Toads or my Dinosaurs for whatever I need. Yep. Um, and Double Strike. Nice, nice, nice. With the call, you can get the um the ultimate, right? The ultimate. Ooh, okay, you can get it back. Is that so a nice. secret rare? These are originals, yeah. I bought them when they first came out. And the spell lineup, I gotta tweak this one a little bit too. But upstart because I need draw power. Yep. Uh, Fossil dig. This is your searcher for all the dinosaurs in your deck besides the main one. Yeah. Uh, these are supposed to be twin twisters, but I, did, I couldn't find them before the tournament, so <laughs> I, just, just fuck it. I just threw in three yeah. MSTs. It, it works, but this deck, you want to get babies out of your hand, baby yeah. sources yeah. into the grave, so twin twisters yeah, be better twin twister is really good. as fodder, yeah. or just any dinosaur in general. I mean, if twin twister says destroy, oh my god, it'd be even better. Oh, yeah. It's just nuts as hell. The simple fact is that if I, I want shit in the graveyard for this guy, yeah. so the more I can put in there, the better. Yeah. Um, I also run uh, two of the field spells. Okay, cool. And a terraform and a searching. So why do you run two? I see a lot of people run three. Yeah, I was gonna ask the same thing. My choice for two was simply because the terraforming will allow me to search it out. Um, oh yeah. But I'm playing two engines. Oh so yeah. So I have so to give away from I need the space for both engines. Uh, you don't have to play two two engines. Um, I only chose that because I love the frogs. They can grind heavier than a lot of other decks can. Mm -hmm. And uh, the simple fact is, at one point I was playing pure dinos with the tin goldfish. Yeah. But um, it was too many times where I was getting out grinded. I didn't want that anymore, so I'm yeah. trying to be really Nice. So that's it for the spells, right? That's it for the spells. Uh, traps, uh, extra. Yeah, we'll start with that. These extra. are my tokens. 
Nice, we got some OG tokens. That's right, OG tokens. OG tokens. <laughs> nice. People are always amazed when they say original. <laughs> um, I play my rank twos. We got Cat Shark, Gachi Gachi, Calvary. This new guy who just came out. Yeah, he just came out. He's amazing for rank twos. Yep. He's freaking amazing. Um, if I had, uh, which is actually kind of difficult, but the only unfortunate part about him, I can't get his during either player's turn. Oh, okay, yeah. Because you have to use Phantom Knights. Yeah. Okay. That's yep. the only problem. But other than that, I played two of him. Yeah. Just for the problem monsters out there and stuff like that. If I have to get over something, because a lot of my yeah. guys are weak besides my dinosaurs. Yeah. So, you know, Tony needs to get over something. I bring out this guy. Yeah, you run two of them. That's good, right? Uh, rank fours. Yep. The basic uh, rank fours. I wanted this set right here to actually be Utopia of Lightning. Yeah. Yeah. Utopia and Utopia of Lightning. Yeah. But I let my friend borrow it. So yeah. Uh, F Zero. Just cause. Yeah. I put this together real fast. For dinosaurs, I play. Triple Lagia. Yeah, three Lagia. Nice. Triple Lagia. Double Doka. You don't need three Dokas. Yeah, you just know. <laughs> two's nice. Two's nice. Is that a common mistake? People always think you need three. Well, it's all. It's honestly player preference. Yes. But the bottom line is, you're gonna be going more into Lagia than you are Doka. Yeah. And also remember, guys, it's all up to you. It's not what you see. It's all up to the personal player. And then I'm supposed to be playing three toads, but I couldn't find one in my tens. Yeah. So, two toads. Nice. So um, you want to go off to your side deck or my side deck? I it was a quickly put together side quickly, deck. Yeah. But just to give you guys some ideas of what you can side deck with yeah. this deck, um, it's the typical stuff. Um, Mass restrict. And what is this good against? That's good against every deck that tributes, which means Infernoids, Monarchs, stuff like that. Yeah. So mostly for Infernoids. Yeah, Monarchs. Everybody, yeah. 60 card Infernoids, and Monarchs are coming back in Link yep. Summoning, so you might want to pick these up. Yeah, um, really start going up. I play uh, Double Flying C for every Exceed deck. You know, um, Stop them spamming. I set a lot with Duke Frog and Ronin Toad in, so yeah. sometimes I trick people and I put in a Fossil Dino. Nice. And they assume that it's a dupe or something like that, so they yep. overextend and then they attack. Oh, yeah. Bye bye, everybody. So, <laughs> bye bye. Um, these are dinosaurs, so I side in the True King. Oh, yeah, yep. Um, then you got double Gamma Seals for every, any problem monsters. Um, I play Toad, so Winter yep. Cherry just in case, and uh, a random quaking. Right. Yeah, it comes <laughs> off with the, um, the conductor, so it's all good. Yeah. yeah. Alright, so before we end the video, you have any shout outs? Uh, shout out to my uh, Yu Gi Oh team, Team Akatsuki. Nice. Uh, Team Akatsuki, that's nice. Yeah, we're joining Attractive Duelist. Yep. We'll, we'll do future videos together. We'll hopefully do some collabs here and there. Um, but yeah, this is the end of the video, guys. So I'll see you guys next time. Peace.